This is Rapid Tech, National Center for Rapid Technologies. We provide training opportunities for industry and education. Uh, specifically with industry, we're looking at a shorter course format than a traditional college semester. Uh, and we are, with an industry type education, we're looking at a specific skill set that we're trying to improve to allow that company to become more competitive. And with the educational side, what we're really looking at is how do we infuse this technology into traditional programs such as uh, AutoCAD or SolidWorks or design and drafting programs and, and engineering and pre-engineering programs also. I'm Ken Patton, the executive director at Rapid Tech, which is the uh, nationally funded center for rapid technologies, funded with partial funding through a grant from the National Science Foundation. We focus on rapid prototyping, direct digital manufacturing, and reverse engineering. Rapid Tech provides instructional support materials for post-secondary education for additive manufacturing, as well as support for industry, specifically in the additive manufacturing and secondary process industry. Well, I would recommend Rapid Tech because they have matured to a point where they understand the problems and the needs of industry. They truly can help without much overhead involved. In other words, a company, an individual can go to them with a problem or an idea and they can advance that to the next level. It's really the only group of its kind and they've, they've uh, been able to successfully get support from the National Science Foundation, they have uh, support from industry, and they've really been able to do a, a number of activities including a, a national conference a workshop every year for uh, teachers and other uh, educators throughout the country. They take on projects for the private sector and they, they, they have a, an excellent staff and the, the quality of the work is, is, is top and it's just a, it's a real privilege to work with, with Rapid Tech and the, the people there. So first class. The primary industries that Rapid Tech currently serves are aerospace, automotive, consumer products, architecture, art, and entertainment, medical modeling, and medical device manufacturing. We originally written a grant for some instructional support material or to develop some curriculum to teach additive manufacturing in the classroom at a collegiate level. What we found was nothing existed. The vendors of the equipment couldn't tell us how to operate it. The vendors of the material couldn't really tell us how to operate it in a format that we could actually use in the classroom. So uh, our executive director, Ken Patton, and myself wrote a grant to allow us to develop instructional materials for use in the college classrooms. Now, what happened there, we found out that there was a great need in industry as well for instructional materials specifically to train either an incumbent workforce or a newly generated workforce, a new hire. Um, and, and that actually led to the National Center. After two iterations of projects grants, developing our first grant developed curriculum, our second grant developed the actual uh, instructional support materials, and our third grant we were basically named a National Center uh, because of our level of expertise within the industry and within the educational community. I'm with uh, DSM Somos. My name is Vincent Adams. I'm the uh, global marketing manager for DSM. I recommend Rapid Tech because they are cultivating the future of our industry. They really can help us most, I think, by continuing to educate the various different industries through the, uh, the conferences that they host, the training uh, sessions and so on that they host, as well as just educating the up-and-coming, you know, bright future engineers of tomorrow. A multitude of different ways, presentations, conferences, white papers. We actually host an annual teacher training workshop for educators at our, at our facility. Now what that is, is that's a, that's a four-day hands-on workshop for educators that want to know more about the technology and the secondary processes involved. So they can actually come in, they get to, as I always say, they get to, you know, kick the tires and light the fires on the machines. They actually get to utilize the machines and the secondary processes. They get to see what's actually involved with doing that. 
and how, how they can actually use that within their classroom environment. We also do industry workshops. We do several per year and we actually do hands-on workshops at the industry seminars. So it's the industry event where you have the greatest number of technicians in the field available at the same time. I am an uh, engineer at the Boeing Company in St. Louis, uh, primary products, aerospace structures, uh, and we fabricate using additive manufacturing techniques. I endorse the people at Rapid Tech uh, because they're innovative, they're creative, they are people persons. They go out and they find a need and they fill it. Um, they are disseminating the information that needs to be disseminated for layer additive manufacturing, for rapid prototyping. Uh, they are very receptive to suggestions from our industrial advisory board and uh, it's a pleasure working with them. Ed Tackett and Ken Patton and the whole staff, they, they go out and actively search out for teachers, they search for counselors, they search for students, and they have a real drive to pull the industry forward and produce students uh, that can, can produce in industry. That's their mission, and um, they, they're achieving their mission. Where this benefits them at is if they're anticipating purchasing a piece of equipment, it allows them to see exactly what they're getting into as far as the facility, the maintenance requirements, the operational requirements, and any specialized skills or training that they need to go to. Now on the flip side of that is the industrial side of it. We know what a school is going to need to implement this technology in their school. So we a lot of times we'll work with the, the companies themselves as they package uh, equipment to go into schools to make sure that they're not forgetting anything or that the support is in place for that instructional program. Now on the industry side, we tend to push the envelope as far as what we can actually do with these machines. And in the process of doing that, we've developed several processes here that we take into our workshops and actually teach people how to use these newer processes to develop better and better prototypes or now additive manufactured products. The list over the three years we've been in operation is well over 500 companies, so I couldn't begin to list them all here. But some of them on the larger size would be Boeing Aerospace. We've worked with Kawasaki Motorcycles. We've worked with Hester Studios, who is a, a master, Tom Hester is a master maquette modeler who does feature animation characters uh, for DreamWorks and, and many other studios. Uh, we've done training for Pixar Studios, Mattel Toys, and many, many others. And those are more of the bigger brand names, I think, that you would recognize. But we also work with startups. We work with individual inventors who have a concept and come in with CAD drawings of a product they think will be a successful to take to market. And we assist that individual or small business roll out a new product by taking it cradle to grave in the early work with it. This is Rapid Tech, National Center for Rapid Technologies.